Today we are cleaning out my closet. We are getting into the cans. Each week I shop my fridge, freezer, and pantry and use my stick to your budget checklist to make sure that I'm staying on track. This makes sure that I shop my house first, then I shop the sales, then I make a meal plan and we make sure that I stick to my budget. And well, yes, I was shopping my pantry every week. Some things just continue to get overlooked and I noticed that I kind of need to, to rotate things out a little bit more in certain areas. So last week I went through my packets and this week I'm going through my cans and we're really gonna focus in on what I can eat out of the pantry from my cans. Now the good news is I have a couple of events coming up. So I'm gonna be able to use some of the cans that I have to make some pasta salads as well as a dip. So today I'm using the rest of the rotini and bow tie pasta to make a couple of pasta salads. We're gonna do a buffalo chicken and a chicken bacon ranch. We're going even more pantry friendly because I've got my canned chicken for both of them and we're just gonna use those so I can use more things for the pantry. We're gonna start with the buffalo chicken salad. I'm just making both of these in containers because we're gonna take them to a little barbecue or we're gonna go uh, over by the water and bring our grill, it's gonna be fun. So I drained and rinsed my rotini. I have about a half a pound, a half a cup of ranch dressing. You could also use blue cheese here. Quarter cup of mayonnaise. And we're gonna start with a half a, a quarter cup of wing sauce, but I'll add more hot sauce if I feel it needs it. And um, I'm actually just gonna, I drain and rinse my cans of chicken. Then you just wanna add that chicken to your pasta salad, give it a good mix. And then if you'd like, you can add about a quarter cup of shredded cheddar cheese. I had some on hand, so I decided to add mine to it, uh, but you don't have to. And then just taste it to see the heat factor. This is a very light buffalo flavor, so I'm gonna kind of double down and put some hot sauce in it. And I also added about another quarter cup of mayo, so I think a half a cup total, because I like mine a little mayo-y, but it's all up to you on how you like your pasta salad. So this is ideal, because I can just pop the top on, and I just put like a drizzle of extra ranch and extra buffalo over the top, because why not? Uh, and a little sprinkle of scallions, and here we are. Pretty easy. I feel like I killed so many birds with one stone today because I also used up the rest of my wing sauce. So that's another condiment that I used up. So I've got about a half a pound of bow tie pasta. I've got a can of chicken that I rinsed and drained. I did put like a paper towel over this. It's still a little wet, but that's okay. I am gonna use about a half a cup of Parmesan cheese. Another thing I get to throw away. A packet of ranch. We're just gonna go to town here, crumbling in some bacon. Piece de resistance. We've got about a half a cup of sour cream and we will add more if we feel like we need it. I'm already going with more because it's so good. Now you can always top this with some scallions, maybe like some more bacon crumble. I was like, oh man, I used all my bacon. And I remembered I had these babies. These are perfect for sprinkling over after. So like, even though maybe you saw your bacon like me, look how pretty that looks. Doesn't everything just taste better when it comes out of a Tupperware like this? That's how you know. That's how you know it's the best. All right, so those went over super well and they're gonna be perfect for any summer gathering. Next up, I'm making a corn dip with Greek yogurt. And this I brought to a birthday party. It was so easy to throw together. Like no one even noticed that I was missing from the house for a few minutes, just mixing it. I used corn and Rotel. So you wanna get started with a cup of Greek yogurt and then a cup of mayonnaise. I was working hard to use up the squeezed mayonnaise, which it like squeezed mayonnaise is amazing for camping and stuff like that. But when you wanna get the last bits out, it's almost impossible. Then for seasoning, just a teaspoon of garlic powder. And then you want one can of drained Rotel. That's the diced tomatoes with green chilies. And you could also just use diced tomatoes and a can of green chilies, that's fine too. And then one can of drained corn, a cup of shredded cheddar cheese, and a teaspoon of black pepper. And the flavor in this is incredible. And so I love it because this is like stuff I usually have around my house. So it's really easy to throw together. And then you could also use sour cream. So if you don't have Greek yogurt, you can use sour cream. That's totally fine too. And it tastes really good. I, I interchangeably use the two, depending on what I have. And then we used, um, I just used regular corn chips because that's what I had, but the scoop corn chips would be really good too. And then even just plain tortilla chips, also fantastic in this. So this is seriously perfect for any event and it's very enjoyable. If you missed me getting started on this whole journey of clearing out my cabinets, go ahead and click on this next video where you can watch what I made with my packets.